Hey, what is it, guys? It's you, John. Today we are gonna be playing as Kale and the top and the mid lane. Um, we are against an Azir, so it's a terrible matchup. We're gonna be trying out the buffed Luden's Tempest. This act, this item actually got buffed 200 gold, and it was actually a decent item with Kale with Everfrost, which also got buffed. But um, we kind of dropped both of them in favor of Riftmaker because Riftmaker is kind of broke right right now, and yeah. The thing with Ludens, it's, it's a really good item if you want to go for short trades. But it just doesn't compete with, um, what's the item? Riftmaker, because Riftmaker just has so little counterplay right now, especially with overgrowth and condition. With the amount of HP you get, you become so tanky. Like, people stop actually focusing you in team fights, so that's why it's actually so broken. Uh, this is really good to burst people down. They're very squishy, so we might actually make use of it uh the azir matchup is terrible guys it's actually one of the worst mid lane matchups with yone with lissandra i actually think lissandra is really bad uh is this guy F afk that is the question okay he's here um it's really bad because this guy's poke is insane early game he also has an insane amount of wave clear so Yeah, good luck, Gus. I haven't really uh, done any fun builds lately, guys, because I've been playing a lot on my main. As you guys have seen, like, most of my videos lately have been on my main account. So that's why I haven't really done a video about even the new items. I want to make a, a video about split pushing kill with the new item. Uh, I don't remember its um, name. It's the new split pushing item. It's really good for split pushing. I want to make an, uh, a build with that, but I just haven't. I haven't even done a build with Ludens, which is kind of insane. Because normally I'm the first person to make new videos about like the new items of Kill. Yeah, I just been concentrating a lot on my main. Uh, I did go. Doran's shield and second win just to sustain this guy's poke a little bit. I will be able to carry mid to late game. The good thing about Ludens is that it, it builds off of, well, Ludens have Everfrost, is that they build off Lost Chapter, which is a very broken item early game. You can actually rush Ludens like as a first item instead of Nashor's too, but it's not terrible as, um, as Rift Maker. Russian Rift Maker is not really good, honestly. I'm gonna I'm gonna rush it this game, even though I don't think it's the better play, just because you guys want to see Ludens, obviously. It's the point of the whole video. So yeah, I'm gonna rush Ludens first. Uh, I'm gonna go for boots and Doran. I mean Dark Seal first, because I mean it's just our core with AP but Kale is just really good. If we go back with 1300 gold, we might just rush um Lost Chap there though. Okay, we're level 5. I'm gonna try and help this guy out. This guy's kinda low. Oh, one more auto attack? <laughs> he actually missed his E. Okay. As I said, uh, this guy's poke is kind of nuts, guys, so. Oh, sad. I actually wanted to hit that. Good thing is fleet does give us a little bit of move speed. And the move speed works out really well against this guy because you can um, obviously escape the sand soldier range. So it's, it's actually really good. Once we got level 6, this matchup does become a little bit easier. Oh, I'm lagging. Okay, what is that, man? Literally lagged for no reason. Okay. Dude, 
You should calm down, dude. I give this guy move speed here. Um, unfortunately, I'm not level six yet, so okay, we could do this 100%. Okay, I actually got him. Uh, maybe that flash was not. Ne I mean, yeah, I think it was necessary. I did. I, I didn't take a lot of damage because of that flash. I think I survived because of it, which is pretty nice for us. Uh, we have enough to buy Lost Chapter. And actually, Boots. I, I think, like, we, we can, like, it's better to just buy Lost Chapter and, um, Dark Seal. I think it's just better. Boots are really good in this matchup, though. Again, if you can get away from the Sand Soldier range, he doesn't really do that much damage. Whoops. Missed my auto attack there. Yeah, this guy this guy can all in me and kill me. I'm just gonna back here, honestly. I was gonna push back to me, so I don't really mind. Oh, uh, we have six CS on this guy. Uh he does have like an item advantage right now because he did back, so I just wanna back, honestly. Grab my items. Grab this. Actually buy a uh a potion here is actually gonna be like decently good. Okay, we need 1900 gold. I'm not gonna TP into this because it's a cannon minute wave. Uh, like, yeah, it's gonna be able to push it, but I'm not even gonna lose minions because again, cannon, cannon minion takes like seven sh uh, tower shots, so I'm gonna come back to it. No reason to GP in this situation, guys. Oh, and I lost it because I suck at the game. Okay, we're good. We're maxing our Q against this guy because we want short trades against him, especially since we're not rushing uh, Nasher's Tooth. Going for short trades is very, 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 very beneficial in this matchup. Like, even if we rush uh, Nasher's Tooth, you don't really want to try and all in this guy. He does a lot of sustained damage. He's, He's kind of like Cassiopeia. They're like both range mages, but they're gonna do sustained damage instead of just burst. So all inning them is not really that easy. And kind of a slow game right now. We're not like we're not trying to go in. Obviously, I mean we're kill after all. So, uh, I was just gonna kill you, dude. Yep. Okay, I don't really mind that. As long as we get our first item, I think we'll be fine. I have to be a little bit careful with this guy trying to all. He can push me into his tower range. I'm not gonna go like near his tower right now. Oh, sad. I really thought that would hit him. poke him down a little bit oh by the way guys i i love um uh oof, that's a lot of damage okay i love using fleet with um ludens because it like it synergizes very very well i should have hugged this wall i don't know what i was doing top side i knew that uh castix was top side okay i like how these two synergize together because you get a lot of move speed with like fleet and also with Luden, so you just go in, burst someone down, and get a lot of move speed, and just go out. With this move speed, with uh, Luden's Tempest, and with your W, it's just an insane amount of move speed. Okay, this guy's here. I actually gave him blue buff. Okay. Unfortunately, I have no flash and no ulti, so I don't really want to try and do anything stupid yet. I just have to wait for my cooldowns, guys. Just have to wait for my cooldowns. We do have an insane amount of mana with uh, Lost Chapter, though. At the end of the day, we are kill, so we're scaling, man. Oh, 
Overgrowth conditioning isn't really that good with Ludens because you don't get the amount of HP you normally get, right? Uh, it's just better to go Rift Maker if, you, if you're going to go Resolve Tree. And most of the time, with Ludens Tempest... Oh, this guy's going to go top. Most of the time with Ludens Tempest... Um... Wait, I have to concentrate here. I'm gonna word that. Okay, got a double kill there. I might die here. Oh, I'm good. Okay, so I was I was saying most of the time with Ludens Tempest, uh, you're gonna go domination secondary because you're gonna need the uh, sustain because you don't really have Rift Maker, so. You're gonna go Ravenous Hunter, but I mean, Fleet is also good with um, this because you get a lot of. Um, well, since you get a lot of AP, you're gonna be healing a lot with Fleet and your W, so. I also got a uh, blue buff there, which is kind of nice. Okay, I, I basically have enough for my item, so I'm just gonna back here. I really wanna grab my item. Uh, I don't like that play. I'm gonna buy that. I have enough. Like I have my Ludens now, so I'm basically just gonna rush Zerker Greaves. Normally, I, I go Zerker Greaves with um this first. I just had really nice buys to buy like full AP. I actually warded that. Uh, uh, I don't recommend pulling me in there, dude. I have a lot of move speed. Let's go, man. The move speed you get from Ludens is so nice. I'm bursting these people down, man. It's just so nice. Okay. I'm gonna... I, I really want to back and grab my uh, Zerker Gibbs. I really need them. I, I need the attack speed right now and also the move speed. Very important buy right now. Okay, so this guy's teleporting, so I can't really take any plates. Honestly, I don't really mind that. I'm just gonna back. Start uh, building into my Nashor's Tooth. gonna ping this because i know that this guy's gonna go top side here uh red buff actually made me miss that minion sad i mean viego's bot side so i don't think we can contest this i'm just gonna hug this side of the wall I'm gonna try and push this in level 11 Word that. Mm, I'm not gonna be able to kill this guy, unfortunately. Yeah, I can't even pass this wall, man. Okay, at least I got two kills there, right? I actually got one kill. Uh, this guy got another kill, so. Oh no, wait! This guy didn't even die. What? I I, I really thought they both died. Let me just push this in, dude. Okay, we're good. I'm gonna leave. 
It's a good thing about Kale ult, you can literally just kill people for free under tower. I hope this is not worded. My thorn is named virtue, and it burns eternal. Okay, we have uh, these two items. Uh, Nash's Tooth obviously is going to give us an insane spike. Like, this th this is the best um, item for kills. Just such a perfect item for her. It's literally the best, the, the, the best item for AP kill. No question asked. That's why you rush it basically every single game. I have my wave since I am level 11, so... Uh... I'm pretty sure you don't want to, like, get near me, dude. Okay, I know that Cassix is this side, so I'm just gonna roam towards our top side jungle. Try and take this, maybe pressure the cannon afterwards. You don't really need Ravenous Hunter because you do have your fleet and your sustain from your W, so you don't heal full a lot. Just if you're gonna use this build and you and you wanna go resolve secondary, try and go fleet, guys. You will need the sustain. Not much I can do there. Very far away. Need 1150 right now. This guy's 3 and 3. I can actually flash for him and kill him. Like if he gets near me. Not worth it right now. Okay, that's actually worth. Oh, uh, reason why I flash for him is because he's 3 and 3. Like, he's actually worth something. So, just gonna flash. Try and take uh, the free, um, uh, free kill there. I have enough for my Nashor's Tooth. I actually want to back, grab my Nashor's Tooth before my uh, before the dragon spawn, so I can actually be very very strong. I'm insanely strong right now, though. They will break against my heart. Uh, I don't think I need to TP. Like if if it's needed, I'll just TP like right here or even right here. But like Cassix is top side, so this guy's really far behind. He's holding five with sixty nine CS at eighteen minutes. Like the Cassix is really really far behind, so. There's no real reason they can contest this at all. Afterwards, just buy, like, go full AP, guys. The only thing that really changes from the Rift Maker build is uh, the Mythic item. Uh, just go full AP. <coughs> Mate, you don't want to do that. You don't want to do that, man. Very good. We are good. Oh, uh, I'm gonna wait for that TP. Yeah, you can't. Like, this game's over, man. Guys, remember to leave a like and subscribe. <laughs> like, this game's already over. We actually probably end here. <laughs> oh my god. The burst you got from this item is so insane. Like, not only the move speed, it's, it's literally just the burst. Like, most people buy this because of the burst, obviously. Oh my god. It doesn't have as much sustained damage as Riftmaker, but just the burst is insane. And you're also not as tanky. You do have a lot more move speed, though. Just attack moving. When, when you're against stealth, guys, try to attack move. Because as soon as they get off stealth, you actually auto-attack them. Don't want to use my mana right now because I'll, I won't have enough for ulti. I, I mean, game's over, so. <laughs> 
GG. Uh, do I think uh, this item will be meta? Uh, no, I don't think it will be meta. It is 100% viable, though. It is 100% viable. Because it was viable before on kill. But it won't be meta, because I just think Riftmaker is just so insane. Riftmaker doesn't have any counterplay at the moment, so... I'm just gonna end the game, honestly. It can't really stop me. Easy. Well played. Have a nice day, guys.